Hi, this is Phil Hinton, and welcome back to avforums.tv. And we're on the TV, and we're going to turn around and speak to George again. So, uh, George, this is the LH, sorry, the H9500. Yes. And it has wireless technology. Tell us about that. Basically, it's the benefit of being able to stream content from your HDMI and other devices directly to the TV without any cable, any wires, or any type of solution that means that you have to connect it to the TV. So the great thing, as you can see here, is that these devices, such as the Xbox down here, connects into the Media Hub, and then the Media Hub communicates directly to the television up to 10 meters worth of range without any cable connection. It's the pinnacle of technology at the moment of wireless. People want to stream content around the different parts of the room, but without having to run cables. It's the worst, worst thing in the world. So we're, we're looking to offer the wireless solution next year into the UK. It will be launched in Korea. It's currently available in Korea, but it's going to be launched in other, a couple of other countries between now and Christmas. And then next year, we'll offer the wireless solution on the borderless design that you've, you've seen here today on the SL9000. Now, this, uh, this technology, it is full HD, so it is 1080p, is that correct? Absolute standard, yeah. It's full HD, 1080p, incorporates TrueMotion 200 hertz. It has four HDMI, it offers the USB connection for high definition movie playback, including MKV and DivX HD file support. Um, the TV is going to be 55 inches in terms of this year, but it's actually the technology of wireless that we are really wanting to bring to life for next year, um, where we look to offer the wireless solution on top of the borderless design to bring that borderless through infinite possibilities to life. And the, the wireless technology, can, that can pass 1080 picture signals, no problem? It sends an uncompressed 1080p picture, so there's no picture compression at all, and some of our competitors offer a wireless solution that does actually compress the picture. When it compresses the picture, it means you're going to suffer a little bit of picture quality loss. The benefits of the alternative solution are is an extended, extended wide range, up to sometimes up to 20, 30 meters. But for us, it's all about picture quality needs to maintain an ultimate premium. So we've been able to reduce the number, reduce the, uh, the range down to 10 meters, unfortunately. But what it does offer is un un uncompressed picture quality. And I know it's next year that we're talking about, but any ideas of where about in the market this is going to come? Is it going to be a, a high-end uh, option? It's going to be a high -end, it's going to be a high-end option because the level of research and development has to gone into this project of offering the wireless media hub, as we can see under, underneath the actual products here. It is going to be an expensive product because it's one of the first to come to market. However, as with anything, as time goes by, the research and development costs and the economies of scale will start to kick in, and hopefully then we can bring the products out at a, uh, different levels not, and not just at that niche top-end market. Okay, so there you go. That's uh, wireless TV from LG on the 9500. Looks like a cracking product. And as always, George, we'll, we'll get it first for review. That's always, Phil. Yeah, you see, there we go. Get one camera and we'll get the stuff that we want. Come back and join us again from IFA 2009.